Hi friends, in this video, we will see the diet after IVF. We all know IVF is an effective way for getting success. After IVF, complete bed rest is not needed. You can do your routine activities. You have to avoid the activities like climbing the steps, exercising, traveling for a long distance and heavy weight lifting. I am glad sharing few words about the foods that has to be followed after IVF. I am Dr. Savita Ashok Shakti Fertility. If you have any doubt, you can contact us. Subscribe our channel Shakti Fertility and Health and share with your friends. First, we will discuss about the foods that has to be increased in our diet. First is you have to split your meals and take a 4 to 5 times a day. The basic reason I am telling you, we are taking large amount of progesterone in all the forms like tablets, gel, injections and capsules. This progesterone will keep your baby in a safer state and it will keep the uterus relaxed. Along with the uterus, it will relax the guts also. It will slow down your digestive system and it affects your digestion. So if you are having a heavy meals, it will affect your digestive system and you will feel like a bloating, heaviness, indigestion and abdominal pain because of indigestion. So split the meals and take the meals in the very frequent manner. And second is you have to take lots of fibers and water. The fiber rich diets are vegetables and fruits. This will help you in avoiding constipation. And you have to take lots of water 2 to 3 liters per day. The water will prevent you from urinary tract infection and it will help in clearing out all your waste products in the form of urine. So you have to take the food rich in the folic acid. We all know folic acid is important for preventing neural tube defect in our baby and helps in the brain development. So we have to take folic acid in the tablet form also and the diet which is rich in folic acid or all the green leafy vegetables, spinach, broccoli, peas, beans, avocados and sprouts and in certain fruits also like citrus fruits like grapes, orange and lime. So take these foods which is rich in folic acid and take the foods which is rich in antioxidants like you can take the fresh juice and vegetables and you have to take the foods which are rich in all the vitamins especially the vitamin B, E, C, D, E and K and you have to take lots of proteins because the proteins are the bodybuilders so we have to take lots of proteins in our diet. The food that is rich in proteins are egg, milk and milk products like cheese, butter, yogurts and chicken, meat and pulses and you have to take lots of nuts and seeds. The foods that are rich in these are almonds, pista, badam, kaju, black seeds, cumin seeds, pumpkin seeds. You have to mix everything and you have to take every day for getting the nutrients from all these things. The foods that has to be avoided are stored foods or the refrigerated foods which may infect your gut. So try to avoid these foods and raw meat and the raw eggs and the junk foods. We all know all the fast foods are junk foods. So try to avoid it and the canned foods, coffee and the alcohol. And the second important thing is you have to prevent yourself from the infections because if there is any infection like fever or urinary tract infection or some other gut infection then we will not get the success rate. So try to avoid all these infections by taking homemade foods. The third thing is try to avoid stress because stress may release some steroids which may affect the uterine implantation. So try to avoid stress and be positive about the results. I hope you all got some ideas about the food that has to be followed after IPF. Thank you for watching this video.